Welcome to a video for the digitallifestyle.com. In this video, we're going to have a look at some of the new features in Build 23466 for Windows Insiders on the uh, dev channel. And particularly, we're going to look at the new backup and restore improvements. So now with Windows, you'll be able to get a new PC and restore it back to how your previous machines were using the new Windows backup app and the um, some of the services. So this uh, is the new build. And as you can see here, this is the new backup app, which I've just run, so it's called Windows Backup. And here you can choose what it's going to back up. So it's going to back up like pictures, which is actually documents through OneDrive. So that stuff is kind of going through OneDrive. The apps, the Windows Store is going to back those up. The settings, so that's the backdrops, that kind of things. And credentials will be backed up. So let's select backup from there, and that'll start backing that up. And then to test that, what I'm going to do is do a clean install of Windows 11 using an ISO, and then I'm going to restore those options uh, on the on the startup. Okay, so we're all backed up now. So uh, what I'm doing now is I've got a clean install from the ISO, and I'm going to restore that when it's ready. And hopefully, we should have everything as. This machine, which um, there wasn't a huge amount of customization on this machine because it's my test machine, but still, it'll be nice to see how that that works. I have got some apps installed on here. Right, there was one other setting that I wanted to look at. Now there is another setting that's introduced where you won't combine the items in the taskbar. That's not rolled out yet, so I can't see that. But that would be so that um, you don't have. Items co combined at the bottom there. We'll have to wait for that one to to, uh, to be released. There's another setting as well, the more um, adapter options, which takes you to the uh, the properties like that, which is quite handy. It saves having to go through the old sort of control panel way of doing it. Also in this build, there's some extra uh, accessibility on the on the voice access. But what I'm going to focus on this video is this restore. So. Um, I'll uh, come back to this when this PC is ready for the restore. Okay, so this is uh, going to restore the backup there from today, which I've done, so I can restore that. So I've done the restore now with this, so this is that a clean image. And you can see I've got my WhatsApp and Spotify apps installed and some of the other apps installed. The background isn't the same, neither is the dark light mode. I think that's because I haven't activated these virtual machines, so then um, you, some of the personalization gets taken off when you do that. But you can see I've got my shortcuts and everything else. So that's the restore feature kind of built in. If you wanted to restore an existing image, you'd have to just do a, a PC reset, and that would reset the whole thing, and you'd be able to apply the the restore there. So that's the backup and restore with the new build 23466 for Windows Insiders on the dev channel. Hopefully I'll get to play around with this and uh, find out some more things and how we can use it. Thanks for watching this video. You can find out more on our YouTube channel on the digitallifestyle.com.